So we finally got one of these Amazon Echoes and they're really fun, you can do a lot of fun stuff with it, but also we are obviously dealing with some superior intelligence. Check this out. Alexa, what is your favorite YouTube channel? I like the everyday dad and flight path, but 51 drones is my favorite. See, she's pretty smart. Hi everybody, thanks for watching. So yeah, like I said, we just got the Echo. We've been having a lot of fun with it. Now that may or may not have been edited just a little bit. So today what I have for you guys is a product review. This is a case for the Mavic Air. It is a soft-sided case for the Mavic Air. Now I use the Mavic Pro travel bag that comes with your Mavic Pro Fly More Combo Kit for my Mavic Air, and that works great. But I've been shopping around for a case that's designed specifically for the Mavic Air. And as I was shopping for a new case, this company actually contacted me and said, do you wanna try out our Mavic Air case? And it's a company called Dacket. Now I've worked with this company before, but previously they were called Dowby or Doobie or I don't know how you say it, but it's D-O-U-B-I. And it's the same company on some cases that I've reviewed, the Mavic Pro case, the Mavic Spark case. And the thing that I like about this company is they have improved over time. The first case that I got from them was good at first, but after about a month, uh, a couple things went wrong. The, the blue part of that foam came off because it was a separate piece. One of the zippers broke. And so every case that I've gotten since has been improved upon. And that's what I really like about this company. They listen to their customers, they listen to feedback, they change their manufacturing, and they make the product better. The other thing that I like about this company, it's a little less expensive. Their products are a little bit cheaper, but they're still great quality. And, and so I agreed to do the review, check it out, and let you guys know what I think. Now, if you order this case, the first thing you're gonna notice, at least the first thing that I noticed, is when you get it, you see that it has additional stitching for this handle. And I think that's really important because with repeated use, this handle is gonna wear out, that stitching's gonna wear out. And so they have some additional straps here around the corners, which actually makes it not only sturdier, but makes that strap sturdier for long-term use. Now, when you open the case, when you open this case, you're gonna notice a couple of things, at least I did. The first thing that I noticed is it's that really hard EVA foam and that's pretty much the standard now and I'm glad that people are going to this because that soft foam uh, even after just a few uses you know starts to tear and pieces of it start to flake off but this hard EVA foam is going to last I think a long time. The other thing that blue part that part that's made to make it look a lot nicer is actually very secure it actually looks like it's part of the EVA foam and so you never have to worry about that cracking or coming off of the black part of the EVA foam. The other thing that you're gonna notice that I think is really cool about this case is, is it has this separate uh, flap in between the cover and the case. And if you open this flap, it's attached with Velcro and it has these little pockets in here. And you can put your propellers in there, uh, you can put your ND filters, you can put extra cords in there, whatever you need to store for quick and easy access, you can put it right in that flap. And then of course the cover does have the zipper pouch, has a ventilated pouch, and uh, so you can store lots of other things in that pouch as well. And so I do really like that flap. I like being able to just to crack it open, go ahead and grab a couple extra propellers or grab an extra cable or whatever you need. It's right there. Now, when you look into the storage part of this bag, uh, each of the cutouts fit each part of the Mavic Air Fly More Combo Kit perfectly. And like for instance, the Mavic Air fits in there really snug. And once you put your Mavic Air in there, it's not gonna be bouncing around at all. The other thing that I really like about this case is the pockets are really deep. This is a deep well case. And so anything that you put in it is gonna stay below the level of the pad. And so when you close the cover, it's not gonna bulk up like some other cases do. In particular, a lot of other cases that I've looked at, the charging unit, that charging block and the cords, when you put those in the case, sometimes that charging cord doesn't fit in that pocket. But with this case, it does. Everything stays level and below the top of the foam. And I do like that. As for the controller, you can store the controller in this case without taking the control sticks off. You know, with a Mavic Air, you can remove the control sticks, put them inside the controller. You don't have to do that with this case. You can slide it right in without taking the sticks off. 
Now this case does have four uh, pockets for batteries for your Mavic Air, and then you can store one on your Mavic Air. So you can actually have five batteries in this case. And I think that's really important because with the Mavic Air, I've only been averaging about 16 or 17 minutes per flight. And uh, so if you're going on a trip or if you're going on a long flight, it's nice to have extra space for your batteries so you don't have to charge them all the time. Now, like I said, this case is designed for the Mavic Air Flymore combo. I did not get the combo. I just got the Mavic Air by itself. And then I ordered two additional batteries. But if you did get the combo, it does have a slot cut out for the uh, charging hub. And it also has a slot cut out for the power bank adapter. And so everything that you need, you can put in this case as well as a lot of other extra accessories. Now, when I review a product, I always try to find something that could be improved, something that maybe bugs me a little bit. And there's just a couple of things about this case. Number one, it does have a very strong smell when you first get it. And I think a lot of cases do have that. And that's that EVA foam, that's that manufacturing smell. Uh, I have left this open for about three days outside and it no longer smells. And so when you first get it, you'll notice that, wow, this really is pretty strong. But when you leave it out, leave it open, in particular outside and let it air out, after about three days, the smell is completely gone. And so uh, that's just one small thing. The other thing, and this goes for a lot of cases that I have looked at, um, one thing that does really bother me when you set this down, and this is so trivial, but it does bother me, that it does not sit you know, at a perfect, uh, you know, angle. It's not at a 90 degree angle. It always sits tilted like this. And for me, when I put this in my vehicle or something, it's gonna tip over. And like I said, I know it's trivial. It's something that's very small, but it does bother me. And uh, so I had to come up with something negative about this case. Otherwise, everything about this case is great. It does come with a shoulder strap if you like to carry it on your shoulder. I don't like to use a shoulder strap. Most of the time I just grab the handle. But if you're one that does like to carry it with a shoulder strap, it does come with one of those as well. Now, I actually have three cases for the Mavic Air. And this is one of my favorites, but I do have two more that I'm gonna review later on. And I'm probably gonna keep just one of those. And so, I'm gonna give this to one of you guys. I'm gonna give it away. Uh, I'm gonna send it to you guys as just a little thank you. You know, nothing special, just a thank you for supporting the channel, being loyal subscribers. And, uh, and so to win this case, there's just a couple of things that you have to do. You have to be a subscriber, which is easy. You have to click on that thumbs up button, that like button. That is also easy. And then lastly, I want you guys to comment uh, down in the comments below, just let me know where you guys are from. I wanna get to know you guys. You know, you guys know me, but I wanna get to know you as well. And so that's gonna give you one entry into this contest to win this case. There's another way that you can get more entries. You can get five additional entries into this contest if you do one thing. Now I finally have a business mailing box uh, that you guys can send stuff to. And what I'm looking for is simply a postcard. And if you guys wanna send me a postcard from where you're from, you don't even have to write anything on it if you don't want to, just a picture of where you're from. Uh, maybe if you wanna write something on there that's you know cool about where you live, go ahead and do that. And uh, after two weeks, I'm gonna gather all those postcards. You know, Maybe I'll get one, maybe I'll get 100, but I'm just gonna gather those postcards. That's gonna give you five additional entries into this contest. And so if you send me a postcard plus comment below, that's gonna give you six entries. So I'm pretty excited to have a box, you know, a mailbox that you guys can send stuff to. You can send me snail mail or anything else that maybe you wanna highlight uh, from where you're from. And maybe I'll put it on my channel and say thank you. So if you guys wanna send me anything, go ahead. The address is down below in the description. Also to the winner of this case from Dacket, this Mavic Air case, I'm gonna throw in a hat. Uh, you know, people have been requesting uh, my 51 drones uh, gear, in particular the baseball hats. And so I'm gonna throw this in with the case for whoever wins it. Just a small token of my appreciation uh, for your guys' continued support of the channel. So that's all I have for today. Like I said, I'm gonna do some more reviews. It's been one of the longest winters ever. I can't get outside to fly. And so I've decided this is a good time to do some inside videos and do some product reviews. So hopefully within the next week or two, it's gonna get nicer out. I think it's January 97th right now as of the taping of this video. This winter will just not go away. So anyway, keep an eye out for some more product reviews in the next few days. Uh, but otherwise, I wanna thank you guys sincerely for watching. And as always, fly safe and fly smart.